and Clara. From today on, you will find a video of HapCut tutorials uploaded on my channel every week. This video is the prospect introduction. The software used in the tutorials is FSCut 8000 bus system, which possibly is the most common control system for LED power laser cutting machines. I will try my best to explain all the functions and parameters of the system, but there will inevitably be omissions. If you don't find what you want, please go to the official website to check. In addition, although I'm not working for FSCAT, if you need related products, I can still give you a price. You can ask me for a quote. FSCAT 8000, which is also HapCAT, is available for LED power fiber laser cutting machines like 8000 watt, 12000 watt. It will be better alongside BRT cutting head because there are some exclusive functions enabled by the couple. Regarding HapCut, let me briefly introduce its characteristics that are different from SIPCAT. Processing and nesting are completely separated, so separate nesting software seems necessary. However, HapCut supports remote network push tasks with SIPNEST. DXF, RXD, GNC, and other graphic data formats are supported, and international standard G data generated by systems such as ACTCAT and LANTEC are accepted, making it convenient for users to quickly import external data. Video Remnant Reproduction allows you to quickly drag parts onto the remnant for processing. Equipped with a variety of auxiliary tools, such as automated nozzle cleaning, nozzle replacement, joining switching, laser centering, etc. Powerful expansion capabilities, up to more than 30 PRC process editing, more than 50 programmable process. The main content will be only available to members and the videos will be displayed in multiple languages, currently confirmed to be English, Spanish, and possibly Portuguese, Russian, and German. Updates will continue to be once a week, and I hope more friends can subscribe and like my channel. Thank you very much. See you next week.